Hey guys, what's up? Rhino Gamer here, and welcome back to Farming Slavery 2013. Let's play. It is the second part, the final part of the last episode of season one of Farming Simulator 2013. Let's play. I sold everything, despite the um crops, because the governor wanted us out now. Yeah, he changed his mind. Like, as soon as I stopped, like, broadcasting this to you, or recording, he called and said, Yeah, about the move, you have to be out now. And he was a very nice about it. He used some words I should not repeat, but... Yeah, we're here at the, uh, at Grandpa and Grandma's house. Um, we are just about to take a look at some new states to go to, and, um... Yeah, I got a little over 3.2 million dollars. We're taking Grandpa's tractor with us. This thing will be with us everywhere we go. Even if we do go overseas. In the future. Anyway. So. What I'm going to be showing you next is two maps that I want you guys to vote on. In the comments section down below. Which one I should we should do. For Farming Simulator 2013 Season 2 of the Let's Play. Because. I I don't know. I don't want to pick a map and be like. or And you guys be like. Dude that map sucks. I don't like this. No I want your guys' input. I think you guys should have a decision on where we go for this Season 2. So um. Yeah. Enjoy. And I really do encourage you guys to. Vote in the comment section below. If we don't get enough votes for some map, for the maps, then I'll just pick one. So, uh, yeah. Enjoy the rest of the video. And welcome to the first map we will be looking at, called Idaho, USA. Home of potatoes. It's not actually called Home of Potatoes, it's just Idaho, USA. Um, yeah, I took some money out as a loan to buy this four-wheeler to ride around the farmyard. So uh, let's go check it out. We will be playing on the difficulty of hard next season, so yeah, yeah, just so yeah. Got some. Oh, I forgot to sell any starting equipment. Oh well. Well, I sold some, I think. Got our storage shed. We got a lot of sheds. Oh wait. Oh yeah, John Deere. Yeah. Got some tools here. Got blue torch and welder. New Holland. Pretty good grass equipment. More John Deere. Hey, where's the case? John Deere and case are pretty good. Let's see what's in here. Looks like last dinner is left the door open. Hey! We got a jack and the work area. That's pretty cool. I've never actually seen in the inside of, it, of that. So, this looks like a nice big barn. I think I have to go up to the door in the corner and press O. Yep. Oh. Take a look inside here. Got a little bit of a work area here. Looks like you got your seeds and your fertilizer here. That was pretty cool. Nice big, uh, I almost said garage. Nice big storage shed, machinery shed. Check out the silos. I think there's something special about these ones. Yeah, these are all in one silos, so you have to search, you have to skim through the crops to get the one you want. It's a little more realistic. Uh, where I live, I actually have silos on my, on my property, and that's what they do. They just have, like, the farmer goes there to select the crop he wants, and as much as he needs. Yeah. Kind of comes out here. Yeah. I think these are fertilizer tanks as well, I believe. Let's take a look. And hydrous ammonia, yep. Fertilizer. Oh, well, we got even more down here. Don't bust through the fence. Oh, man, we can bust through the fence? That's not fun. Let's see here, what's this? Uh, oh. Looks like the root crop storage barn here. I gotta say, I love the textures on this map. 
especially the dirt. That looks awesome. Got silo or silage bunkers and possibly a silage silo. If so, that'd be great. That'd be really cool. Uh, assumingly, this is the cows. Yep, that's a straw in here. Nice, huge barn here. Love the styling of it. Very do, very do. I mean, very good, very good. What's in here? Got the water. A little bit, little bit high for my computer, but whatever. Nice grass. Grass looks really cool in this map. Got the random bales everywhere. I think that's it for this farm. Now, if I remember, there's another farm here. Yeah, there's another farm here. Uh, I think we'll go ahead and check that out. Drive through town real quick, too. Because from the pictures I've seen, the town looks really good. It does. Like, <laughs> really good. Dig you guys up there. Actually, while we're down here, we are right here. We own 13, 1, 10, 7 and 8. And what are they growing? We got corn. What's that? Barley. Wheat. Wheat. And canola. Sweet. Uh, this... I think it was this map that came with this mod. The, uh, in-game menu enhancement. So... Kinda wasn't able to review it yet. Let's go down here. What's this? Oh, wow. You got direction signs for you. Awesome. Speed limit sign 55. I did turn traffic on, so we have traffic finally. What's this? Old Santa Fe boots and saddles. Oh, that's pretty cool. I just knocked over a sign. Whoa, 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 whoa. I got stuck on a sign. Wow, check the lights out. Lights? No. These aren't lights. This is a town. These are lights. This is a whole town. Got our... Oh, look. Got an old tractor here. Probably can't get in it. I'm not even gonna bother. Looks like we got this school here. What's this? Famous potatoes. 75 years. Celebrate with us. I'm assuming is what that says at the bottom. Celebrate. Yep. Celebrate with us. Mobile One. <laughs> awesome. Oh my god, McDonald's. This is the best map ever. Okay, we're making it. We're making it. Oh, it's my nap. We are making a stop. I'd like a. I'd like a Big Mac with no cheese and a large sweet tea. Okay. I'm gonna drive through this person because apparently I can. I don't care about picking it up. Looks like the tractor supply co is where we pick up the tractors at. Pick up the tractors at. That makes sense. Now what's this? Is this like the museum or something? Oh, whatever it is, I just walked in here. Oh wow. Giant deer, nice, nice. Got some crone. Some good looking crone too. <laughs> All right. Got some fent in here. New Holland. I don't. I don't know. Not like New Holland tractors per se. I, I'm not trying to offend people, but I think New Holland should just stick to hay equipment. Got some giant deer, some class, some more class. New Holland giant deer. John deer. Looks like we got some internationals up there. Nice. And got some more internationals. And a versatile. I think that's called. Pretty cool. Charges Placo. So this is like their headquarters building. Awesome. I also think that this building has is a workshop. I just ran into this fence. Huh. There is a fence that you can't go through on this game. Or on this map. Yay. Okay, so let's go over to the main farm. Or the livestock farm. And, uh, yeah, see you guys 
Well, I don't know. I don't think I'll see you guys. I just got out for some reason. Um, how far is it? That looks pretty far. Um, yeah, I think I'll... Nah, I think I had to leave it. Uh, you know what? I'll go ahead and cut. And after we after we pass this BGA, because there's something special about the BGA. After we check out the BGA, then we can cut it and see you guys in the farm at the farm. So take a look at this BGA. I like saying BGA instead of BGA. This BGA sounds really good. You say BGA, it just gives me a little attention. Now, it's your typical BGA. You dump your silage in here, you get the stuff from it, you dump it in the thingy. Now, however, you come in here and you can buy all this. So it's pretty cool if you ask me. I'm not sure how it works, but uh, for now, uh, we gotta check out the livestock farm. So, see you guys at the livestock farm. Coming up to the livestock farm, we got a little gas station there. Nice. This is a, this is a nice farm right here. We got the long dirt road with wooden fence along it. Grass field on the left and grass and other fields out to the right. American flag. Mercury. Now I believe this map has chicken chickens. Uh pigs and beef. Let's see. Um pigs and beef. Yep. So you got different cows to grow here. Grow? No. Raise here. Looks like you just drive up to doors around here and they open. I just see gas. Oh, the barrels are gas. Okay. Yeah, okay. Looks like these are your pigs, I guess. I'm assuming these are your hog confinements. Either hog or beef. Or maybe it's just one and one. So I'm not seeing much else around this farm. Yeah, it's only these two. They are separate, so. Got some sheep area there. The auto auto wool collector. More fertilizer and seeds. And assuming the fuel. What's this? You got your beet store, your root crop storage. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you just come in here to get your green now? It. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Yes, you do. Okay, that's cool. That's really cool. Uh, you're missing a pipe up there, dude. You guys know that? You're missing a pipe. You're missing a pipe. It's just not connected. I don't think they care. So, another silage silo, chaff silo, I should say. Another barn. This. This map creator really knows how much barns you need. That's what that's something I find a lot of trouble with. Nowhere to put all my stuff. Good chicken area there. Okay, I think that'll do for this this uh, map. Let's go on to map number two. And welcome to number two of the two maps. This is this map is Midwest USA. It doesn't say in the in the description. But yeah, Midway, Midwest USA, pretty flat map, pretty basic map too. Uh, again, gonna be in hard and bought the part of the money for for, for this tour. So we are gonna just drive around. Got the in-game in equipment, which will definitely be gone. Don't worry. Got the typical farmyard. What's this barn back here? Like this is so out of place. Cause you got the normal in-game barns and then you have this big round barn. Is it just that? Just a big round barn? That's what it seems like. Ok, 
Okay then. A huge grass field or hay field, whichever one you prefer. Got some rocks everywhere. Next big cow pen. I don't like that red barn though. That red shed right there. It's kind of stupid. They put that one on. It's too bright. <laughs> it is. Okay. In game silos. You can see how much wheat, barley, or wheat, canola, corn, barley you have. You got your chickens. Where's the sheep at? Where are your sheep? Where are the sheep? And I actually don't see the sheep. This is a cow. Do we not have sheep on this map? Cows are in a sheep zone. Unless, unless the cows are in the sheep zone are the same. Which I don't know why we would. Oh wait, it's a. Uh, what's this? I need to go to field number ten. It looks like that's the sheep. I wasn't paying attention, I guess. I didn't see it there. Let's go over there and check it out. See what it looks like. Got pretty big fuels on this map, we do. I think number five there is the smallest one. I do. Get over to the sheeps. Got a little bit of terrain detail here. How it deforms in spots. That's pretty cool. So we own this field, which is not planted. Kind of sucks, but whatever. We got a huge field of corn and wheat, so I think it makes up. Okay, so this is the sheep, right? Right. Okay. So, uh, do, 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 do. let's see here. Where do you pick the wool at? I'm assuming it's right there in the. Oh, no, right there. Right, right there on that map. It's really a basic map. Like, this is really there only is to show. I mean, you got the silos that which don't do anything. I think it might be a store point. That's it. Like where you can just dump your grain and you pick them up over there, I guess. I don't know. So, pretty, pretty basic maps. It's a pretty cool map, too. But, again, it's just very basic, you know? I mean, it's flat. It's just a bunch of big fields. So, um, yeah. I guess there's really nothing else to explain. So, uh, yeah, that's it for the final episode, part, whatever you want to say, of Farming Summer 2013 Season 1 Let's Play. Make sure you guys please comment down below which map you would like us to play next next season. Uh, probably be about a week or so before I tally up all the votes. And, um, yeah, so make sure you vote. And till next time, I'm the Internet Gamer, and see you all in the next video.